the starting point is to open out the diameter of the existing hole. The hole is then carefully cleaned out to get rid of any loose dust and debris that might affect the quality of the resin fixing. A plastic sieve can then be fully inserted into the new hole. The next stage is to inject resin into the hole, withdrawing the nozzle slowly to ensure the hole is completely filled with resin. After the resin is set, the bolt is to be removed. Picking up the new thread that's been formed in the resin, the bolt can now be replaced into the thread and can be fully tightened. A test rig is now positioned against the wall to put a load test onto this new bolt fixing. Remember, the original bolt that was put in could be pulled out of the brickwork by hand. Once the test rig is correctly set over the bolt, the test load can be slowly applied. The engineer has now achieved a load of 4 kN and carries on until he achieves 8 kN. He decides to end the test at this load point as it already conclusively illustrates the capacity of the resin anchor and any further loading will only stress the brickwork and cause unnecessary damage. Under the circumstances that we have here being a heritage building, when the scaffolding is finally struck, the bolt can be fully removed, uh, which is a, a requirement of the heritage organisation.